it's my second day of waking up at 4 30 um how do i feel i think i'm feeling better than the first day but i think my body is still getting used to it because it's still not as natural to me as waking up at 11 i think but i do believe that it's gonna become more natural as i do it more and more and becomes a habit for me why am i doing this like why am i waking up this early why am i punishing myself i want to kind of experiment if that makes sense i have always woken up late and i've always heard about the benefits of mornings and the benefits of waking up early so i thought why not try for some time and see whether i see a change in my life honestly the last two days have been pretty productive but again i want to see this in a long term so i want to see how does my body change my habits change and my routine changes as time goes like a few weeks i am still trying to get around eight to six, like seven and a half hours of sleep because because if i sleep better i will more likely to wake up feeling better and i try to like go to bed at eight and fall asleep at 8 30 or 9 o'clock i am just so tired by that time my body automatically wants to go to bed so that was the most natural time for my body i just don't want to exert myself if my body like if i want to sleep i don't want to force myself to stay awake at 10 or 11 if you are watching this right now you know i think it's a good way to experiment in your life and in your routine because even research shows that mornings are more productive doing exercise in the morning is better um your motivation is higher in the morning doing harder tasks is easier health wise it's actually better for you to wake up in the morning so yeah, this is my second day update of this week i will update you guys as i'm going along in the week and see how my response and my routine changes by like i don't know seventh day or like eight, 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 eight. so what am i gonna do after this i will eat breakfast now and then hopefully get some study done I'm like a cup of shroom tea in the morning. Cut your throat like hot honey. You gon' need water, then wash your mouth. In your head, you gon' slip. So today is the day three of waking up at 4 30. i didn't get to film a morning update because i was feeling very lethargic in the morning i realized that unlike day one and two where i was feeling very mentally refreshed to wake up today i woke up feeling tired not physically just mentally my first thought waking up was oh here we go again it was only like an hour later i felt more energized and i think that might have to do with going on a walk you know this is me filming it after the walk and feeling way more energetic but i also noticed that as i woke up and followed my routine I was feeling much better like I felt okay I got this I know what I'm doing I didn't have to think about it which is you know what happens when you build habits you keep doing the same thing again that mental kind of energy that you need to put into thinking about something or doing a new thing wasn't there for me today like going on a walk in the morning was easier yeah filming like videos in the morning was easier I cleaned the whole house like that was easier for me than on like Monday where I just it was a new day so it took me like five minutes of convincing myself okay do this you have to do this that is what i've noticed on day three another thing that i've noticed is i'm finding it very easy to keep keep on giving myself more and more work and i'm pushing myself a lot more so i have to not remind myself in the middle of the day that you know just take it easy don't like exert yourself so much that by the, by, by the end of this week you are gonna be exhausted and you won't even want to repeat this ever again so i am trying to like build good habits but building it in like step by step manner and i will see you in another your throat like hot honey you gon' need water then wash your mouth in your head you 
gon' slip. I love on you, and then I leave you alone. You want to get to know me? I'll agree in exchange for your soul, please, baby. You taste like maybe, baby. I feel like now after you make a habit you have to maintain it and you have to see the long-term effect of it so I'm more trying to see what it is in a longer term so it's been around two weeks since I've been waking up at 4 30 or 5 o'clock I did not find I, I can never find a time to film in the morning because I have things to do and I look horrible <laughs> so this is me updating you in the middle of Sunday after I filmed like two videos I think the biggest thing that I noticed was it's very hard to be very very consistent to the absolute terms to wake up at exactly the same same time every single day and not feel different is I don't think so humanly possible like I do not want to make myself be feeling the same thing I don't think so I can do that and I can never wake up at 5 30 exact -ish. and it's usually like around 4 20 4 40 and I let myself like that time that that flexibility I give myself that because it makes it easier for me to have choice and um, have uh, like room to breathe but also be like following a routine but I think that what's been really helping me maintain a consistency is is having a morning routine it is so important to not just have a consistent time to wake up but also to have a consistent routine to follow afterwards some things that I noticed that I think can help you wake up early is if you want to wake up early you have to have to have a good sleep routine as well and a good sleeping time so I'm waking up at 4 30 and that means I have to kind of get to bed at 8 or 9 o'clock and that will help me not feel that tired the next day and want me to sleep and want me to wake up and I think if you can do that that will help you wake up early having already decided what I'm gonna do next really really helps me because I don't wake up and sit for like half an hour thinking what am I gonna do next the moment you do give yourself tasks which involve a lot of pondering and thinking I feel like I want to go back to sleep. so I usually give myself energizing things to do or things that do require some reflection but they're not around my bed they're not me just thinking like quietly and like kind of falling asleep as I'm thinking about it so I usually have my timetable I usually have my to-do list already made from the day before having like breakfast to look forward to or having Having something to look forward to in the morning really helps. With me, it's coffee. Like, I really <laughs> I like the taste of coffee. And I avoid drinking coffee at night to have a better sleep routine. So, my best time to drink coffee is in the morning. And I want to drink it. I wake up. So, that really kind of makes me, like, want to wake up. I do change my clothes as I wake up. So, that, again, brings a barrier between me and the bed. So, I'm not going back to bed. Another thing. <laughs> wow, there's a lot of things. The days where I, like, wake up slightly later are days when I'm thinking in my bed. So, if you can, try not to give yourself like lay in time to sit in the bed and just think because the more you're gonna lay in and think the more you don't want to come out because it's like you know cold the days that i the moment my alarm goes off i get up and go and to brush my teeth are days where i'm like waking up consistently and actually feeling slightly better than days that i stay in the bed for like 10 minutes going through to my tiktok or like my instagram and that is like not like you can see the difference i can feel the difference so try to get up right away and lastly you want to wake up early and you cannot
not and you find it very hard think about why you're finding it hard figure out what is preventing you from waking up early and maybe try to change that and see if that works but yeah that is just my i think this is the last time i'm gonna update it before i upload this video because you know who wants to see me in like third three months i hope you like this video and i hope to see you in the next video so yeah bye <laughs>